Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and today it is Stratter Day here at Norman's Rare Guitars. Woo! Yes, and we have a really, really cool guitar. And it was also a fun day today. Saturdays are always eventful. A lot of cool customers coming by. Yes. And just having a good time. We love seeing you guys. And uh, yeah, this guitar we got. I've been waiting for it. Norm <laughs> didn't let me put it on Guitar of the Day yet. He was holding it because we were figuring out some stuff, but here it is. And it is really cool. This is a 1962 Fender Stratocaster refinished in red. Ooh. And it is a lethal machine. Uh, really, really cool guitar. So. I said red just to keep it safe. I think it's Dakota red. Some people think it's Fiesta red. I think it's a little darker than that, but it's somewhere in between. And it is really, really, really cool. So first off, the first thing that I love about this guitar is the slab board. Um, and you can usually tell it's got that kind of like rounded off um, when it meets the maple part of the neck at the headstock. Um, and that just means you have a thicker piece of rosewood and it just has a certain it resonates a certain way I would say um, it definitely has a buttery just warm sound especially with that slap board not only rosewood but the slap board especially but look at the back of this neck amazing you can already tell there's just so much there to work with and so much life to this guitar and the wood of this guitar um, some really cool wear on the back too um, you've got four springs in here. The bar, I'll actually utilize it today. It, it, it works great. Of course, you could always take out one more spring and loosen up a little bit more. Um, not even L on the plate, so it's pre that. Um, really cool. You can kind of have your mint guard. Three-way selector, they kept it that way. Sometimes when they refin these things, they like to turn them into five, but I think it's cool that they kept three. You can always have it sit in between and still get those sounds. Um, has a period correct case. Uh, no case candy, but you don't really need it with this guitar. I mean, it's always good to have it, but this guitar deserves to be played and deserves to be played by someone awesome. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Not me. Yes, I'm, you. <laughs> but I know I'll take it out and I'll take it for a spin for that person. <laughs> but a uh, really, really cool guitar. Um, also, I like to call red strats with the rosewood board the emoji strat. Yes, it is. Um, because if you look at your emojis, this is the guitar that they <laughs> chose to represent every guitar in the world. It's true. Now you want it. <laughs> Alright, we're going to take it out front and see what we can do. Let's go. Let's do it. Woo! Alright, we're out front with the 1962 Fender Stratocaster. This is refinned in a red, I'd say a Dakota red. A really cool guitar. Um, it's also got the slab board neck as we covered in the back and a good weight too. Um, we're going through a Fender Super Reverb starting off on that neck pickup. Let's see what we get.
I'll pick up and see what we get.
Stratocaster in Dakota Red. Really cool. You can check them all out at normanjerryguitars.com and also on Instagram and Facebook. I'm your host, Michael Lemo. See you soon. Bye. Whoa. That was awesome. Yeah. Man. <laughs> wow.